when we're doing the concept cars, it gives us this opportunity to kind of really look beyond. What we've done differently here is we've slowly moved away from the physical architecture of the screen. It almost looks like there's nothing there, but it's this invisible layer that we're bringing into the atmosphere. Yeah, I mean, it's quite magical. You get in the cabin and it's this beautiful lounge space and you, you kind of look for where is the information. And then when you put the glasses on, you get this magical layer up here and it brings everything alive. So it's based on using the, you know, the potential of augmented reality. And uh, what that means very simply is uh, putting a digital layer onto our world around us. What we're calling that is Audi Dimensions because we have multiple dimensions we're bringing into your experience um, and we're going to take you through your journey. How that works is we have a number of optical layers and information is projected at different depths and then there's a number of cameras on the system which allows it to map and track the surroundings and that means the information can be placed in the right place at the right time. There's also further cameras for things like hand tracking because we have more natural gestures where you can actually interact with this information. One of the hero moments in our system is um, when you put your hands on the steering wheel, when we move from automated to, to manual driving. And this is where, within the uh, Audi Dimension realm, um, information transforms from spatial to driver focused. The second one is in the Grand Sphere, we had the concierge where we have gesture control. You know, you're in a relaxed position, you can't reach anymore. Now we can decouple that information, relocate it wherever we want. So you have interactions at your fingertips. So the, the benefit uh, with Audi Dimensions is that we can deliver the right information in the right place at the right time. And the beauty of augmented reality or what we're doing here is it's a multi-user experience. So other users within the system can view the same content at the same time, or they can choose to have their own personal space to consume whatever media they choose to.